everyone and this is Alex from the Ready for Departure channel and today I'm sitting in this nice shadow near the international airport on Skiatos, Greece. This is one of the last days that we are here shooting some videos for you, meeting great people including some famous YouTubers and pilots and this video will be about the tips and tricks that you probably will need when you come here to Skiatos for some plane spotting. Okay, first of all, I can tell you that in the summer there is a really strong sun and you have to hide somewhere. And this place like this is the best point to hide if you don't want to spend any money. Of course, there is some kind of the bar over there right near the sporting place, but you have to buy something and maybe you don't want it. So just walk to the local port and cross a little bridge over small river and you are here look great shadow almost full day except when the sun will go to this uh, side of the runway but it's it will be like 4 or 5 pm and the sun is not that strong that's the first trick if you don't see any traffic and you don't have a car your hotel is so far come here buy some food and be here without afraid of sun heat or something trick number one shadow Trick number two is the food. Five minutes from here, the Scalavinitas, the biggest market, I guess, in this area. You can buy everything there, including even the chairs, sun, um, umbrellas and stuff. So, if you want to sit right near the sporting place, like our friends here, uh, you can buy it all there, quite cheap, and be right near the runway. So, food, drinks and stuff, cheap. Number two is the Scalavinitas over there. Okay, if for spotting places, this place you can use as well because if you are into the photos or videos, from here you can have a nice pictures of the airplanes flying by so i can try to get the airplane in front of the city but maybe it will be still too high and it will i will be unable to do this but i i want to try that's my idea so the first point is here it's not the most popular because everybody wants to stay right under the airplanes but it can be used as well from here especially if there are two or three of you who are filming the videos you can one guy from here another guy from there uh, the third guy from somewhere else and you can make a nice coverage of the airplanes hitting the ground well I, of course successfully
let's try to shoot a video from this point as you can see near the shadow bench and right now Olympic ATR almost on the final and we will see how it will look like well you can't see the touch down from this point usually you can't see this but it's a nice pictures as you can see of uh, airplane flying by in front of these hills behind me uh, at the evening when the sun is already on the other side of the runway i like to use two points first point for the takeoffs is right near the yellow danger sign with the airplane drone there and another point is the barrier that you walk you can walk and choose the distance you need to the aircraft depends on your priorities so but 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 my main advice when you filming on skiatas never ever film in the yellow lines there is a yellow lines on the road and saying no plane spotters beyond these lines because if the airplane take off it's really danger when it's landing it's okay maybe when the low landing you can lose your head but uh, it's not happened so much but during takeoffs the deer the stones small stones everything coming your way and if you value your lenses if you value your techniques cameras it's better not to stand there and uh, as well as you get shaky if you're shaky you can get a nice picture and it's really a really hot wind hot air I, I can say so I don't advise filming from the yellow points from the barrier especially if you're coming there with the kids I saw two days ago there is like a six-year-old kid trying to stay at the fence and I'm gladly happy that his father told him to move away because We've seen pictures and I can show you the video where the huge guys are almost falling into the water and it's really dangerous. So beware of the yellow lines and find your spot somewhere safe, safely for your cameras, for yourself and it will be best for you. It's another time of the day and I decided to show you exactly the point with this hill uh, on the left side from the runway 01 from which you can get a really nice view of takeoffs from zero one and in front of the sea of the people especially if you have a good zoom so let's see i'm walking over there maybe somewhere down there over the fence maybe more up so i can see the whole runway i want to finally have a chance to film a gear up procedure uh, from the close distance in Moscow we don't have such opportunities actually there is no places so I walked all the way from there and you can see there is some kind of business jet right now uh, almost preparing for the departure almost ready for departure yeah subscribe to our channel and we do expect two V's air air Serbia from Belgrade and I think Voltaire from Napoli I think if my mind is clear after this really really strong sun so I'm going to up the hill and I will show you the, uh, the view from there it's not that easy actually because this bushes almost like um, you know this chain against people coming above the fence I can't remember how it called with nails uh, net net not chain with the net nail net I don't remember how it called actually I do risking my life right now but you can see I want to get much higher that's why I'm trying to do it right now I hope I will survive okay okay 
Okay, almost there. Oh, it's so hard. I can't even put the hand. Oh yeah, I guess that's, that's the place. The, so we are finally on this spot. It's spot number, I guess, free on the spot guides for this airport. And as you can see, we have a really nice view over the runway from almost the beginning of the runway 01 to the end because after the spine there is a little uh, more space and the, that's all uh, you can stay here you can be a little bit lower and you can go uphill and i guess there is some kind of road over over there so people can just drive there and stay uh, we are now expecting, as I told you, some airplanes, some nice airplanes, because Air Serbia still is not in our back for this airport. It's always delayed. Actually, there are so many air airplanes that delayed for this airport, and you sometimes can't catch. There are lots of people over there waiting, and most of them are checking the schedule of the airport, not Flight Radar 24. And sometimes they're just staying, standing there for nothing, for hours. Okay, I'm waiting. This is my camera over there, resting right now. And let's wait. Okay, so this probably my main tips and tricks for the skiatas. Uh, what about the hotels? I don't know. If you come here only for plane spotting, maybe you have to get uh, some places on this side or opposite side of the city, some expensive or and middle expensive village like uh, villas like this here. They absolutely. Uh, I'm sure, uh, well, I know that they are on Booking.com and they have a nice view for airport. If you are into the beach, into the sea, uh, into the swimming, uh, if you are into the beach, swimming and stuff, maybe, and you have a car, you can take another side of the island for like Kokunaris or Banana Beach and just come here on the car in time for interesting airplanes. Right now, here is a pause. I did Transavia, Edelweiss, and all I have to do is just wait when they will be ready for takeoff. Frequency for the Skiatas airport. If you have a receiver, frequency. Uh, oh, you see? Let, let's let's listen. Hello again, go ahead. Yes, sir, just for planning a which departure runway and the departure SID to Previtsa, near Exec. Edelweiss uh, 364, I will advise uh, if you can uh, depart visually from runway 01 with a left turn to Garta. Otherwise, uh, it will be with a right turn to Garta. I will advise as soon as possible. Roger, we should be fully VMC if we can uh, accept any visual departure. Huh? You see, a receiver. 
Si Fuadu. Ed il 364, anche il wind è uh, calmo, so quindi aspetta il departure from runway 01. Ok, 01. Ho avuto un po' di paura che they will make a departure from 19. I don't know what for. Ok, this is a receiver and the frequency is uh, 126.050. Uh, this is a scatter tower, clearance, taxi, and, and everything. Almost everything. Uh, you see? Uh, do you have um, an estimate time for departure? Uh, yep, that is uh, 0755. Uh, I think uh, we should be ready on time. Okay, sir. I will advise. Thank you. Okay, yeah. They will be on time. That's great because my plans after this two airplanes take off, I will go straight to the Kukunaris beach for some great swimming. Okay, this was the video for tips for plane spotting on the ski atos. I hope I covered everything. Well, of course, you can have a lot of nice food in the city. Everything is so great on ski atos. You can come here by airplane by ferry boat you see there this big one with the cars already uh, from the mainland of Greece so enjoy the stay on the Skiatos and I hope to see you somewhere here if I will be able to get myself again to this lovely island in Greece it was the Alex from the ready for departure channel and well, I hope you enjoy our channel, support us, watch our videos, we do the best to bring you, well, of course, not yet probably the best content, but we're always trying to make it even greater than before. See you!